Hi, I'm Mark Polk with RV Education 101. Window shades by United Shade are a great add-on for any RV. Depending on the type of shade you select, they can help minimize sunlight and provide you with privacy in your RV. If you own a motorhome, one type of shade available is a privacy windshield shade. Some motorized shades can be programmed, and when you install a motorized windshield shade, it's important to program the limits the shade can travel when the key is in the on position and when the key is turned off. In today's video, we're going to discuss and demonstrate how to program a dual switched motor with a learning wire. Let's get started. The first step is to make sure the shade is installed and positioned correctly with the hardware appropriate for the mounting surface. With that done, we are ready to program our dual switched motor with learning wire. A dual position rocker switch, similar to this one, is required for shade operation. The shade motor is wired to the dual position switch and to the vehicle's ignition switch. There are two programming modes we're going to discuss and demonstrate today. Programming with the ignition switch set to on and programming with the ignition set to off, such as when you're parked for the night. Wiring the motor to the vehicle's ignition switch allows you to program the shade for limited downward movement when the ignition switch is in the on position. This is called short range programming. Long range programming is done to establish the limits for shade movement when the ignition switch is off after you reach your destination or stop for the night. It's important to know that the short range programming needs to be completed first. Here's how you do it. For short range programming, you are setting the upper and lower limits you want the shade to operate while the ignition is in the on position. For safety, do not set the lower limit below the driver's line of sight. To enter the programming mode, make sure the shade is fully raised and the ignition switch key should be in the on position. Next, locate the learning wire switch. It is the wire with the black button found on the motor end of the shade. While holding the wall switch in the down position, press and hold the learning wire switch until the motor beeps. Continue holding until the motor stops beeping. Release both switches. The motor is now in the programming mode. Short range programming, key in the on position setting the lower limit. Lower the shade by pressing the down position on the wall switch. Approximately six inches before the shade reaches your desired lower stop position, release the down switch. Fine tune your lower stop position by lightly pressing and releasing the down switch until you reach your desired lower stop position. When you reach the desired lower stop position, press and hold the up switch and when the motor stops beeping, release the up switch. You have programmed the lower stop point. Remember, do not set the lower limit below the driver's line of sight. Short range programming setting the upper limit. From the position you just left it in, raise the shade by pressing the up position on the wall switch. Approximately six inches before the shade reaches your desired upper stop position, release the up switch. Fine tune your upper stop position by lightly pressing and releasing the up switch until you reach your desired upper stop position. When you reach your desired upper stop position, press and hold the down position on the wall switch until the motor stops beeping. You have set the upper and lower limits for the shade in short range programming with the ignition on. Long range programming. Long range programming is done to establish the limits for shade movement that you want when the ignition is turned off. Remember, short range programming must be completed first. To program long range settings, make sure the ignition is in the off position. Long range programming is done the same way short range programming was done. Set your lower limit first and the upper limit last. 
That's all there is to programming motorized shades with a 12 volt dual switched motor. For more information on all types of window shades for your RV, take a minute to visit www.unitedshade.com. Happy camping.